Hey, hey, flappers! Happy Woo! Tuesday! Did everyone have a hot girl summer? Woo! Yes, I certainly did. I'm very excited for Baby Daddy Fall. <laughs> um, no, that's wrong. It's Pumpkin Spice Latte Fall, and we all just hope that we found a guy during the summer who will stick through the 10-pound weight gain until winter. <laughs> um, yeah, it's been good for me. It's all been good. I'm unemployed, but I'm still here. Uh, you know, I've spent so long on the couch. I'm no longer a couch potato. I am couch vodka. <laughs> I'll let that joke ferment a bit. Um, <laughs> but it's fine. Uh, my last job, I was actually working for a salon company. And it's not that I'm shallow. I know that what matters is what's on the inside of my paycheck. <laughs> so I quit. I was like, screw that. You're not paying me enough. And now I'm like, ah, unemployment is not paying me enough. Uh, <laughs> living the best dream life. Uh, but yay, I get to be here tonight, so that's good. Um, speaking of salons, uh, I've been blonde for 10 years now. Isn't that great? Thank you. Yes. Yes. For my people. Um, I love it. Uh, people always ask me, oh, are you a natural blonde? And I'm like, yes, I'm a blonde. I pay for it naturally. <laughs> but uh, yeah, there's all those stereotypes about blondes, you know, like people think that we're dumb or something. They're like, mm -hmm, E equals MC squared. And I'm like, can't catch me. Those are letters. <laughs> I really love my hair straightener. Anyone else out here? Yes, 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 yes. I love my hair straightener. I just hate it when I burn my vagina. <laughs> the worst. Um, and I get really confused because there's just so many styles available now. You know, you've got like just a regular bikini wax. You've got a French, a Brazilian, or just my favorite, braided. <laughs> I really can't stand like those just very antiquated old men who are like oh does our carpet match the drapes i'm like yeah if you pay for the refurbishment <laughs> it's all good um i don't know i i'm 30 in my 30s i don't even get to say i'm 30 anymore i'm in my 30s and i'm dating in la which means that the other day i was on a date with a guy and i got excited because he had in-unit laundry machines <laughs> this i was like hold on one second wash these right now thank you <laughs> um yeah but it's rough it's like there's so many crazy guys out here like i went on two dates with a man and then he goes would you uh, be interested in going to a kind of costume party with me? Mm. <laughs> I'm like, what does kind of mean in this sentence? He's like, mm, have you ever seen Eyes Wide Shut? <laughs> I'm like, that's, that's, that's a sex party. And he's like, well, there's aspects of that. I'm like, if there's aspects, that's a sex party, okay? Aspects means a sex party. Um, <laughs> and so, yeah, so I'm not seeing him anymore. Uh, <laughs> but I, I don't know. Call me crazy. I'm just looking to find a guy who I can be in a committed, monogamous relationship with, and I don't have to watch him fuck other chicks. <laughs> maybe, I'm, maybe I'm insane. Um, so, yeah, I've had a lot of time, unemployed, so, you know, I decided to use that time for something good today. I did something that women do so rarely, and I felt so proud. <laughs> I washed my bras today. <laughs> Listen, gentlemen, if you knew how rarely we wash our bras, you would not be as excited to take them off. <laughs> I mean, honestly, like, we will spill stuff on our shirt, we'll sweat up a storm during summer, we'll, like, find that part of the popcorn kernel that's, like, you know, the brown thing that, like, kind of sticks and then it hurts and then you're like, what the fuck? And then you take it out and you're like, oh, well, this bra's still fine to use. <laughs> yeah, but anyway, so I just, like... Back to the dating thing for one last second, then I'll leave you guys. Um, I went on a date the other day, and what's going on with the dirty talk right now? I feel like it's gone to the next level, because I was in the middle of passion, shall we say, and my suitor goes to me, oh yeah, my Jew. 
on the train to Auschwitz. No. Just one second. No. I was like, what do, you, what do you mean? And he was like, oh, oh I'm sorry, um, a Jewish. <laughs> I was like, grammar is not the problem here. <laughs> it's not. I was like, if you want a pet name, you're a little matzo ball, you're hunk of brisket, I'm down <laughs> with it. But, you know, this is just, yeah, whatever. Hot girl summer. <laughs> Thank you guys. If you want to know if the carpet really matches the drapes, go ahead and click subscribe. Also, feel free to rub one out on that like button. Was that a creepy wink? <laughs>